What's up guys, my name is Jay and in this quick video, I'm gonna talk about my top five plugins, the ones that I personally use right after I install a fresh WordPress, okay? So as you can see here in my dashboard, I have a couple plugins installed, yeah? But let me show you. The first one is a security plugin, all right? There are tons of security plugins out there a lot of good ones, but this is the best for me, right? WordFence. They have a free version and they have a premium version. I always use premium versions with security because I know that WordPress needs a lot of good security. So WordFence is a great option. As you can see on the website, they, they show you the attacks and all that stuff. And uh, this one have almost 18 million downloads, which is awesome. And you can see here some features that they provide to you. Actually, I love this one, the cell phone sign in. Um, when you add your username and password, they send you a text message to your phone with a code that you have to put after your password so you can sign in. But they have all this stuff like scan, they have a firewall. Now, after I have my security plugin installed, I go and install my backup plugin. So back WP up. They have a free version, they have a pro version too. But all the plugins that I use, the free version actually, they work pretty well. But the pro version give you the, you know, like the, the, the golden touch. But you can see here, they have a ton of um, options like uh, backup on your Google Drive. That's, for me, that's awesome, right? Even in Dropbox, if you like it. I think it's very, very important to have that backup and you can actually schedule the backup so you don't have to go there and manually uh, backup your WordPress. You know that maybe every week or every two weeks you have a backup of that website. Back WP up. Go there and get it, all right? Now, after that's done, I go and install Contact Form 7. This is a free plugin to create forms, all right? Contact Form, maybe schedule forms. They have a date and time module that you can install there. It's a free version. They don't have a premium one. It's all free. So as you can see, the website, it doesn't look that nice. But they have awesome support because they have a ton of people, uh, developers working and helping for this free plugin. And it's super easy to create these forms. Super helpful. You can integrate with a lot of stuff like, like MailChimp or other third-party uh, applications. And that's it. After I have my form done, I go and install a page builder. There's a lot of good page builders out there like Visual Composer, uh, a Beaver Builder. But now I'm using this one, the DV Builder. This one is not free. Uh, Visual Composer is not free and Beaver, Beaver Builder is not free. Uh, they don't have free versions. They, all, they are all premium versions. You have to pay for it. Why? Because when you download this page builder, you have it forever. You know, you download the plugin and you have the plugin forever. They don't want you to get a free version, but because then they will not get paid. They want you to pay it and then they will give you the support for, for one year and updates. That's what they want. All right, so it's fair. I think it's fair. And um, as you can see, this is a very cool uh, page builder. I like it because it's super fast. You can label your uh, these blocks and stuff. And you can see you have all these modules and all this stuff. Look at these awesome websites. Look at this. Very, very cool. Now, after I have my page builder, I'm ready to get my SEO plugin, which my favorite is Yoast, is super famous, millions of millions and millions of downloads and counting. And uh, they have a free version too, but they have a pro version too, which is a lot better. But the free version actually works, you know, works their magic. And uh, the pro version is a lot better. So as you can see, they have 
a ton of features like uh, let's see here um, titles uh, the robots even the sitemaps for Google this, this is pretty good there's a lot of people that don't know how to send this XML sitemaps to Google so they can crawl your website for a better SEO yeah I'll go there and read it read a little bit here in Yoast they have an amazing support so after I have this done my WordPress is ready to go I have everything I need to start maybe you are different you have other ones maybe you can do your own SEO differently uh, maybe another plugin that you really love and you know what if you think that these plugins are not the best uh, to start just leave me a comment below and say hey Jay no that plugin is good but it's not that good look at this one and I will look at it all right I will look at it I will use it and if you like it I wouldn't even create a video for it all right so if you have a, another security plugin that you really like please comment below and let me know so I can take a look at it same thing with the forms and, and backup and all that stuff all right now you can see here in my dashboard that I have all of them installed you can actually install all of them in here adding the new uh, the only one that you can't is the DV builder because you have to go there and buy it and they will give you access to download the builder but you can go to your dashboard and click on add new and then you can search let's say like contact form 7 and you can see here we have the contact form 7 we can click install now I'm using WordPress 4.6 uh, so um, is the one that you can actually install right here and activate right here you don't have to go out of this page but this is the new WordPress is 4.6 okay so if you have an old WordPress it's gonna be a little bit different as you can see we have the contact form right there that's it that easy all right so I hope you like this video guy I know it's a super quick video but it's very helpful because it's very important to know what plugins you need after you have your WordPress ready uh, which one are good which one is bad for me personally those are the ones that I use those five if you have other plugins that you like please comment below let me know all right thank you for watching remember that I'm uploading one video every week so if you want to keep learning subscribe all right have a great day guys Bye.